Team Fortress 2 has a game mode called Competitive, where teams only have 6 players. And winning or losing affects your ranking in the game. Except no one plays in-game comp. It takes really long to get into a match, there are many toxic players and cheaters, and there is no real award to playing competitive. Even then, I have been trying to play in-game competitive every now and then. During my live stream on Twitch, we managed to get into a match, but one of our friends couldn't join. When that happens, the match is simply over, and the game says it is safe to leave. What if you didn't leave and played the game? Well, that is what we did. The final competitive match. What? It's gonna be absolutely horrible. Wow, my favorite competitive map. Ah, uh, we're waiting for who to join? Pepino, join the join. Why did you abandon? Okay, F4, F4. I want, I want to see what happens. Does it actually begin? Why are we gonna play against no one? Huh? Okay, this is the first time I, this is happening to me. Let's go beat him, guys. Let's go. For <laughs> this is awesome. Six bots versus four real humans. I bet Banny cannot do this. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go try to cap. This is gonna be really risky. Oh no! We find a casual match. Aww, I really want to see what happens if you win a match against bots. Yes, apparently, empty player slots are simply filled with bots. Since all the enemy team had left the match, we were legit playing a competitive match against bots. Honestly, it was very silly, but since I was queuing for casual and didn't find a match, we couldn't see what happens at the end. So I queued again for competitive and got into a match to see what happens. Oh, we find a competitive match. Where do you think you're going? Sir? Sir? Sir, aren't you papers? Aren't you see your papers? He's running away. Get him. I had to. I had to. He had a gun on him. He had a gun. Who's the last person? Can we F4? No, we cannot F4 without the last person joining. What a gun. Show me. Show me. You gotta show? We gotta check. We gotta check. It's big slappy. Okay. 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 I, up, I approve that. Okay. Ready up. Oh my god. I just made him disappear. That heavy couldn't handle. Gordon Freeman versus four people. Oh, we're gonna beat his ass. Imagine he actually plays a match and like beats her ass. That would be so funny. <laughs> he full toggles on his cheats. He left, he left, he left. Perfect. This is gonna be so silly. Moving that gear up. Guys, TFT competitive is so easy. I don't know why no one plays this. TFT competitive is so fun. Erecting a sentry. Erecting a dispenser. Erecting my penis. Oh god. B1, GG, GG boys. Okay, now we gotta cap one point and I think that's how we win. Okay, Scott, I I'm gonna tell you what to do. So what I'm gonna do is go up there and push the cards. Okay, let's push him, let's push him. Come here, come here, don't, don't no one need to be shy. You got this. Oh my God, they're actually defending. Look at him, he's actually listening to me and he's cap capturing. You're my best friend. Okay, it's time to draw a penis. How do I... It doesn't let me draw. What? There's a yo, no winner? That's so dumb. We did all that, all that to not be able to see ourselves. Huh. Yeah, like I said, it, it didn't actually count. Well, this was definitely a waste of time knowing that it didn't matter if we won or not. The game didn't even bother to show us at the end as winners. Anyways, I'm planning to make a more in-depth video about competitive TF2. Make sure to subscribe to see that video when it comes out. Also, I stream on Twitch. We play TF2 together. Follow me there too so you don't miss that out. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.